So my name is Michael Generakis and I am the CEO of AssetNote. I've always been interested in computers and um, messing around with it, um, but you know my first real sort of official move into into hacking was you know getting a job as a as a penetration tester out of university and and doing that for a long time. Um, didn't really get into bounties uh, until I met Shubs, uh, uh, my co-founder in, in Asset Note, um, and he really sort of showed me the way. Um, nowadays, being the CEO of Asset Note. Uh, it's kind of all spreadsheets and emails and stuff like that. So bounties are a really good way for me to sort of stay technical, and, and I really enjoy it. It's not like uh, it's not like a full time job, but um, you know you can just you know have fun, poke around things, um, try different angles, and it's it really keeps keeps things sharp. There's two feelings that you get. If you've been hacking on something and banging your head against the wall, but you know something's there and it finally comes together, that's an amazing feeling. But then you also get these bugs where um, they just come out of left field. They're kind of by surprise, they're simple, they're, they have a huge impact, and you kind of just stumble on it. Um, and, and that's just an amazing feeling as well, because it's just like, wow, I, you know, I didn't know that that was there. And uh, even, even after doing, you know, uh, testing and, and hacking for such a long time, um, you know, you still get that buzz. You always get that buzz. Like it never goes away um, anytime like you, you're successful. And even at these events, we see other people get these bugs as well. Um, you always feel it for them a little bit. There's always an excitement um, uh, when, when you find something good. Somebody who uh, takes a creative or novel angle um, to a problem um, and uh, in, in the sort of process of solving that problem. Uh, I, I definitely think um, being a hacker is about the mindset. Uh, it's not so much about the technical skills. Uh, it's, it's really about how you think about things and how you approach things. And one of the great things I love about coming to these events is you, you see the way that other people think and you know how they've come to, to find those bugs and how they've approached a certain target and you learn a lot in terms of how they think and their mindset and that's, that's really important and I think that's what really separates um, you know, the good bug hunters from, from, from uh, you know, the ones that are, are less successful and that's definitely to me as a hacker, is, it's all about the mindset. I, I like hacking on Hacker One. Um, they've got really interesting and diverse programs, and uh, a really good platform as well. Um, that's really friendly to the hackers, and they're super helpful. Um, you know, I was uh, talking to at, at the last event that I went to. I was actually talking to one of the employees and saying, "Hey, like, I'm really keen to to get more mobile stuff." It's like, "Oh, you know, let me point you in the right direction." You know, um, very helpful stuff. Um, really great platform and really interesting programs. Is really what drives it. For this event in particular, obviously, you want to thank uh, HackerOne and, and Uber for putting it on. Um, you know, it's it's been a, a lot of fun. Um, thanks to Team Team Australia, Team Asset Note. Um, it's been a lot of fun. You know, hacking with the guys, um, and uh, you know, I've I've learned a lot. They've definitely evolved to be. Um, you know, more streamlined, um, really focused on, you know, getting good bugs and really supporting the hackers in, in, in getting, you know, value out of the event um, in terms of the bugs, you know, working together. Um, it's definitely, it's definitely constantly improved. Um, they're always a lot of fun as well. And I feel like um, each event that I've been to kind of ramps that up as well, which is, which has been great. Um, it's not just uh, coming and hacking, which is, which is a lot of fun in and of itself, but you know, all the social events around it as well. It feels like, especially this trip, it's kind of ramped up another notch. There's been a, you know, a lot, a lot more, uh, a lot in the way of the parties as well as like there's the sightseeing and all that kind of stuff and a lot of stuff that we can do um, together, which is, which is always a lot of fun. Every event has, you know, they've always got the shirts, they've always got the hoodies, um, but then they always have these sort of unique, uh, you know, bits of swag at, at each event. Favorite? It's hard to say. I really like the shirts. I, I, I mostly, uh, I don't buy new shirts. I just, I just wear the swag that I get. Um, and they're really cool shirts to wear. Like the design, the artwork um, that you guys do in particular is, is really great. Um, and so you kind of enjoy wearing them because they, they look cool. 
definitely um, running asset notes, starting asset node. Uh, in fact, um, you know, bounties is what's allowed us to to sort of bootstrap our company, um, which has been kind of kind of great. Um, you know, because our our platform, you know, was born out of out of the bounty space and and um, you know using it for bounties at least the technology. And so we've continued that. Um, and bounties are a great test bed for us um, when we're doing new stuff with, with the platform. And the nice byproduct of that is, you know, we've made we've made money that we can, you know, funnel back into the business. Get started and do it. Um, you know, there's a, there's a, a lot of um, resources out there now. And one of the great things about bounty programs is when I was getting started, uh, there was there was no bug bounties, right? Um, there wasn't a lot of information uh, out on the internet uh, like there is now, like tutorials and and other stuff and people sharing their knowledge. And so so you kind of had to just sort of figure it out on your own. One of the great things now is like you want to hack on something, you can hack on a bounty, and it's not illegal. Stay within the scope, stay within the rules, keep keep in the spirit of, of of it. But you get to hack on all kinds of diverse real world targets, and you learn a lot. The the other bit of advice is to um, um, really engage with the community. Um, there is a really strong community, especially in the bug bounty space. Um, everybody's, at least in my experience, has been really willing to share their knowledge um, and, and help people out. And, um, and you know, if you, if you sort of engage in that community, you'll learn a lot um, just by, by the association and working together with folk. Collaboration is definitely key uh, in terms of learning stuff. So, um, so yeah, get started and, um, you know, don't sit by yourself, you know hang out with people, collaborate, um, and you know, contribute as well.